Wow, for the first funny time. Enough, funny enough, he actually did, did say he was going to be right back and shit. So once I heard, like, you... Like, once I heard you unmute your mic and all that sort of stuff, I was just like, boy, you're in for a new thing. What are we talking about? I, I, come back to I was about to say, we, this was like the first time I flipped over and you guys were very quiet <laughs> in a long while. In well, a while. We, just kinda, we just kind of like... Mutual. I, had to, I had to be right back. We were, yeah. we were doing our, doing our, our idle chatter. You the, know. Mu the, mutual, you know. the mutual existence of, you know, you both nod at each other. We're plan what what's the plan on assassinating me today? Uh yeah. Um, <laughs> don't say anything. Come on. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, no, it's a surprise. Fuck you. Oh boy, I, I love surprises. Is it is it is it, it, oh, it all right. Is it on the level of like something out of a cracker jack box or are we talking like uh cereal box I prize here? Where's my free decoder ring? Like Oh yeah, right. I forgot I can do that now. Yeah. I always forget I can do that now. Again, that being said, be sure to open up the Cracker Jack. That being said, be sure to open up the Cracker Jack box. You know what I mean? You're just <laughs> you know reminding I me. Mean? Am, am I right, Zix? So you should open up the cra the crack the conveniently placed Cracker Jack box on his desk. You know? You know oh, yeah, no. Let me open that up right now. You know? No, no, you don't open that up. No, no, no. You. It was meant for him. Oh, it's I, I want this fucking prize, damn it! He rigged it to blow up, you fool! We did. That was the trap. That was the whole fucking trap. <laughs> <laughs> that was the whole trap. So, so, why'd you try to do it? Insurance it fraud. Funny. What? Well, he did it because of insurance fraud. I thought it was funny and shit. He knits you a sweater of tears and you kill him. Yes. <laughs> also, I'll be right back too. So we're we're looking for or we're still looking for the pizza. But how how have you been? I know JT launched his new comic that uh, confused me at first until he clarified. Oh, oh don't say that. Now I'm gonna, uh, uh, you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna dissuade people from wanting to read it. JT, I'm dumb. I I I feel like everybody who watches me understands that. I, 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 I can't put two sets together unless I'm writing it up on a page. Like, I, I feel like, I feel like my, uh, recommendations don't go, uh, don't go as well noticed because I'm like, oh, I, I was saying, I was saying, uh, I'm a, I'm a big dumb and a babbling dweeb who can't lift a butterfly. Yeah, that sounds about right. Well, J look, J trust me when I say JT's comics are really good, okay? I'm, I'm being too hard Thanks. on myself. I didn't, like I said, I'm just, I was just, I'm like, wait, what's going on? That's basically it. I, 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 either I was like half paying attention or something. I don't know, but I, I, I read through it. I liked it. The art, the art is nice. All right, now I know you're just blowing smoke up my ass. Yeah. JT. I think you draw better than I do, in all honesty, especially freehand. Have you seen my full freehand with no reference drawings? I don't think I- I don't know if I have, actually. I've been wanting to see that. I've been wanting to see you not use references more. I, I can, like, s I have a few saved in my phone. I can, like, send them to you tomorrow when you're not busy. Yeah, by all means. Because what is so... it? I, it it's, it's, mostly, it's mostly just concept art I did for, like, my game. So... Yeah. Like, if not if not that, then it's just like some some dumb doodle I'll draw and I'll draw on like something or whatever. Aren't we looking for the fucking bean star? We are, but I'm also kind of collecting. Bean star. I'm also kind of collecting beans and whatnot. I'm back and I'm here to say keep going. All the drawings I'm an art. I'm an art. Oh, <laughs> you're good. I'm, I'm, I'm not stopping. I'm never. I'm never gonna stop drawing now. Uh, well, no, well, no, because like I told you, like uh, I told you guys, like literally, my sad, my sad real life backstory of 
Nobody fostered it until like recently, so I'm like, you know, I never had a reason to keep I never had a reason to keep drawing. Uh until now, so it's like, you know, fuck it. I'll keep it up. I like it. It's fun. Oh god, you you unlocked the core you saying that unlocked the core memory. Nobody fostered your art? Hey nameless. No, I had I had I had people I had like I come from a family of like various, very various, various different like artistic talents. Like both of my parents play instruments or know how to play instruments. I was about to say, um, what, what's your dad or what's your dad's artistic talent? I was like, <laughs> he can he can he can he can play instruments. He's like really into music. I'm a dude that can't like, draw. Everybody, what all, are you talking about? What are you talking about, practice. Nameless? I've seen I've seen your. Your drawings are really good. All it takes is practice, my man. Yeah. Even, 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 even if you can, even if you can't, all it takes is practice. Yeah. Like, like, what is it? I, I, I always, I always draw like various cartoon characters. Mm -hmm. Well, I, well, even no, but even, even, even Mutter says that I, I have a art style. Because like he knows when I he knows when I draw something. Yeah. Oh, oh well, GT GT, I, I sent you that Shrike drawing, yeah. Yeah. I did that pose all by myself. I I the reference was the character. <laughs> what? Wait, 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 what was that? The, 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 no. The... Oh. No. <laughs> Intelligence. I'm Joe Ziggler and I approve that message. Not the not the actual like you know artificial. I'm Ger Ziggler, I or... use AI. If you guys saw the chat right now, you would know what I mean. Listen, I know that can be taken out of context and whatnot. But I'm not going to say what it actually is. What? Oh hey, it's Show this guy. Show, show up in person to find out what was said on Twitch.tv slash Merrick If you guess it what it was and whatnot, you win a new couch! Wait, what? Z Zig, is, Zig is trying to get rid of his old couch. He was thinking of selling it for $200. $200 is what this guy's, this bad boy is yours. All you have to do is, all you have to do is get it out of my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> or you win it, or you can win it as a fabulous prize and whatever Zig said before. What did you say before? I was like, what? I yeah, wanted- That's what I meant by AI and all that sort of shit. And uh, you win a new couch. <laughs> Text Merrick Ishtar 1 to the Twitch chat. Merrick Ishtar 2 to the Twitch chat. Or go to my YouTube videos and go in the comments and type Merrick Ishtar 3 and I will throw all your names into a raffle and we will see who will win Zig's couch. <laughs> if you subscribe to the channel, you get two votes. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> here's my gum tree. No, no, no. Uh, well, here's where I live. Here's when I'm not around. <laughs> Zig, 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 we actually get you. We actually... People actually do that. Would you would you raffle the couch off? Um probably. I'll just have to find a way to get into my fucking car and all that. <laughs> but for for what game? Actually no, no, that, that's too much fucking work for that thing. I but uh, JT, you said you said you did want to see like some at least some art. I did send you one though. Oh that... wait, wait! I never told. I never told my um. Oh yeah, yeah. tell your story and I'll tell your story and I'll inform you again. I'll, I'll reinform you because okay, I, I just okay. remembered. So here's what here's what happened, right? Take it back to about I want to say sixth grade, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. I, I, I was someone who always liked to draw, but I was never much like, I was like drawing as like, you know, little, little like OCs or just like, you know, like fan character shit like that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and one day, 
I decided, you know, I'm gonna draw, I'm gonna draw actual fan art, right? Uh huh. Like so, I do all the time. I'm <laughs> right. I, I don't know why. When I was younger, I, I I was pretentious, and I was like, I'm above that, and I'm like, I wasn't. I, and you're not you're not above anything when it comes to when art. you I don't when know you why check I the shit kid. I, I I just I just have some minor thing to add to that. Checking the trajectory of like art views online, unless it's like unless it's like a, a sexy character, the most views on art is usually fan art. I yeah. know. As someone who does exclusively original content online, I know. Draw some anyway. fan art, JT. <laughs> Newgrounds will love it. And then what? They'll come back for the fan art, and then when they see my, see my comic, they'll just fucking scoot on by. Once, it, once again, there, once again, there's some memory to me drawing fan art, and the fact that I, the fact that I'm writing a fan comic for MLP is very funny. And now that we're able to post it to Newgrounds, it's even funnier. Yeah. Fair. But anyway. So I decided to draw, you know, a little bit of fan art in my, in my spare time, and I did the crin the thing, the cringe thing anyone would anyone would do in uh, in, in that time, if you were. The story of Undertale fan art. It was, no, this is way before Undertale. I'm not that young. <laughs> can, can I can I just say something real quick? Some of the hardest shit I've ever tried to draw is Undertale slash Deltarune related. I think I, I, but I, I think occasionally I do fan art when I read. But like, like I said, look, look, there, there is no, there is no, like, just draw, 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 like it's a chore. Don't, like, Listen. fan art, non fan art, do, do something, make something. Listen, as a, as a, uh, That's how you fight back against, a, like, you know, corpos and crap. Sorry. What? That's how you fight back against that corporations. Cyberpunk going on here. No, but it's, no, it's true though. You're not wrong. But like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say do it like it's a chore. I, I, that, that's a half joke because fucking, I'm, I'm referencing an ABGN episode. Oh, fair, <laughs> fair enough. Anyway, draw, draw um, like it's a chore. With, the, with the story though. Yeah, go on. So I, I, my cringe, my cringe ass like twelve year old self. Decided to draw uh, Gamzy Makara, which, for those of you who don't know, <laughs> is a Homestuck home troll. Well, oh, well, I, well I JT, everybody, everybody who's been watching us for the past, uh, how many years now have you been covering Homestuck? Two years? It's only been, has it been it's only years? Been a year. Only it's been, a has year. been a year? No, I feel like it's been two. It like it's been a, it no, like it had to, been no, it has to be two. It has to be two at this point, because... He started it in like I swear you started this in like 2022. When did we play? When did we? When were we? When did we start Tiny Tina's? 2023. No, we started. We, we started like around 2020. I'm lost actually. Because I I made the I made the decision to do it when we, again, while we were, we're playing Tiny Tina's. Yeah. Right. 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 I had to get a new PC just so I could fucking play it. Like, right, we 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 actually had a ses we actually had a funny session zero in Tiny Tina's of all games. Oh god, that was funny. But so I was, but so I I you know I drew games in Makara, right? Yeah. And I like, one of like the popular girls kind of walked up to me and goes, oh oh why would you draw them like that? And I'm like, what do you mean? It's how they look. OMG, like, is just, that is that Homestock? No, no God, that would that would have made my life easier. Wow, uh, no, quirky. No, I, I, wish. <laughs> I, I would no, that would make my life. That's really fucking quirky. I like Homestuck too. I, I will never leave your side now. We are now oh, Homestuck okay. buttons. Oh, We're like brothers, we but closer. No, so they were like, like I've never seen that character before. Why did you make him look like that? And I'm like, no, it's not. I didn't, I didn't make this one. They're, 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 they're their own thing. And they're like, yeah, I've never seen them before. They're your own original thing. And I'm like, no, they're not. They're from Homestuck. Come on, believe me. Did, did I? And they were like, 
Be sorry. And 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 they were like, and they were like, hey, everyone, check out, check out, fucking, check out JT's original character. And I'm like, no, it's not mine. I don't want it. <laughs> the first well, time JT would be embarrassed by Homestuck. It certainly wouldn't be the last. The it first of many. <laughs> and I'm like, and I'm like, guys, no, come on. It's, I didn't do. I didn't make this. And then, like, the unintentional Homestuck bullying is real. Let me tell you about Homestuck. And then, like, and then, like I looked, I went to my friend, and they're like, I didn't look, I didn't look, I, I didn't make them, he got announced for me. And they're like, I haven't seen them either, man. I don't know what you want from me. And I'm like, no, come on! Alright, alright. You, got, you guys want a real, you guys want a real summary of Homestuck real quick? Okay, no, as someone who's been reading Homestuck, what's your, home, what's your summary of Homestuck? Um, I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one with cheese, and a large soda. Oh! That, that's my summary of Homestuck. I, I, you've been explaining it, JT. I've been listening intently, and I still don't understand anything. Aside from they blew up the Earth, and then uh, there's this guy named Lord English that's not supposed to be around for like till the very end or something, and 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 and, and, and like somebody was like a secret furry or whatever. Uh, I think that was just Andrew Hussey in general. <laughs> and I'm in, I'm in, I'm in about like three servers filled with furries, and we we advocate, we ad, once again, I'm just gonna be, we advocate for furries here, right? Online communities are online communities. Everybody has cool shit going on and whatnot, no matter what the case is. Exactly, guys. Hello. <laughs> like, uh, the, the, like. It, 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 there, there's, there is nothing wrong with furries. This is not us being like, you know, making fun of people or whatever. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I say, let me finish before you go cancel me, right? What, what are you gonna say, can say JT? My, can I say my, can I say my one problem with furries? What's your one problem with furries, JT? Okay, so like, I have nothing against you all, but like. Just because I just because I wear an Isabel hoodie doesn't mean I'm one of you. Please stop trying to recruit me into your cult. You know I, what? Fair enough. Fair enough, JT. I I had so many people just be like, like JT, you're a furry, right? And I'm like, no. I just Hashtag like Animal JT Crossing. JT is over party. No. No. Why? No, 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 no. Like, all right. Like, I I even said, like, what is it? It's like no, I, sprinkle I, I, sprinkles I is a furry know, sprinkles is a furry um no. sprinkles is a furry artemis is a furry I, like i i'm i'm followed multiple furries on here and all of them are decent people jesus christ how long is like how much more do people have to do for like the random hate boner against people who either a like animal either like animal character aesthetics or b just prefer to just prefer to like you know represent themselves as like a cartoon animal person. How much more do they have to do to not get shit? Jesus Christ, people! Like the internet is not high school too. Grow the fuck up. You, you know what? You know what that remind, You know what? I that you reminded that always made that part the, the part the part I was saying worse. What? They would always say like. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with being a furry, and I'm like, no, I agree with you. I'm just not one. And then they're just like, and they're just like, well, look, we're not gonna bully you any more than we oh, do hey. because you're a furry. You can just admit it. And I'm like, I'm not. There's nothing to admit. I'm just furry. God damn it. There's everything to admit, JT. No. <laughs> Just because my I use my internet personally, person as a cat boy, doesn't mean I'm a furry. It, it's the issue isn't about the furries; it's about some people being furries. Yeah, it's like, no, like what is it? It's like when it, when it, when a single crab dies in the pot. Yeah, all the crabs die. 
like, what is it, they, like, the term one bad apple spoils the bunch? That's what I feel like people do with a lot of this shit, but, like, to the, to the nth degree. It's like, guys, calm the fuck down. Every fucking thing on the internet has, like, you know, fucked up people in it. There's always the 1% oh, no. of the yeah, fandom every, every fan Oh, fan of, of course, years. of course. So, it's like that, that was, like, that, that's my declaration on it. It's like, I've, I've learned to just say, yeah, no, the people who do fucked up things are fucked up. I, I, like, that's it. Either way. Oh, uh-oh. Same complaints I've heard about furries, I've heard about every other fandom, so if everybody... Yeah, exactly, right? We brony, we bronies got it, we bronies got shit too when we first showed up on the scene. Listen, I'm just a, Listen, I, I'm just some guy. I'm just some guy and all that shit. You know what I mean? Z Z I'm Zig... Real, I'm, I'm a... Zig's a Swiss banker in this situation. No, I'm just saying, I clown everybody equally and all that shit. Oh, hey man. That's new grounds for you. No one is safe. No one is safe. There's too much sugar, you'll get diarrhea. Listen, just go down to see if you guys can get yourself some fucking uh, diarrhea. Same, I'm just here because Merrick raided my Twitch once. Well, you got you got a good stream going on. You got a good stream going on, Nameless. Yeah, so, that's right. Like, we, 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 like, I wouldn't have gone, I wouldn't have gone if it was, if you weren't, uh, funny. Or something like that, I don't know. That sound, that sounds mean. But like backhandedly mean. I'm sorry. I did not. I don't mean to come off like that. I mean like you know. You got. You got. You got good shit. That's what I'm trying to say. It expected. Now I feel bad. Fun only happens when I'm active with people. Tbh. Yeah, no, that's that 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 that's just like the that's just like the 90% of like Twitch streams though. It's either like I, and I, and I and I've gone on record saying this too. It's like if the streamer's not having fun, nobody's having fun. So. Yeah. yeah. There's a whole, there's a whole lot of, like, things to that, uh... There's a whole lot of, like, things to that fucking, um... Uh... I want to say the word spectrum, but I don't think that that's, like, the... I don't think that that's the right word. Look, ba basically, basically... We have, basically, we have... We have double duty here. Some people need interaction in order to be entertaining. Some, some people, like me, for example, I'm, I'm extremely quick on the draw when I see something, and I can have, like, a, you know, like, I'm easily on, like, a, yeah, exactly, duty, 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 doo doo feces, because everybody wants me to say doo doo feces sometimes. Dirty, my dirty, disgusting doo doo feces. A anyway, I, I wanted to tell you, JT, too. Like, you want you want to see art that I've like want like it's not 100% without reference because the character is a the character I use the reference for, but the pose is completely 100% was the monkey wrench fan art I sent you. I was gonna say that is, like pose wise, they didn't look at, look at back. At back except, and the only, the only, the only issue I saw was like the knee looked a little janky, but like, cause I, I like, cause I was that looked good. Yeah, I, even I noticed like the uh, June game. June. I, I, you know, the knee, like, I, even I was like, the knee's a little weird, but he's got like long legs. He's a weird character, so I was like, yeah, I could probably like skip out and then, you know. It was saved in the edit by the digitization, I think. I don't know. I'm weird. My proportions are weird. I, I can't get scale right. My brain is smushed. How are y'all doing? Um, My name's Merrick. How's y'all yeah, doing? My part. name's Merrick. This is Zig and JT. I'm Merrick. Uh, I'm Zig. I was going to say, like, 
really want to get down proportions and all that sort of shit. Um, the average, the average human body is about eight, eight, eight heads, give or take. That's what I remember from my fucking drawing class. It, no, it's, um, five, five to six. That was eight. It's your actual head, then I think it's two heads for the torso, two heads for the legs, and then one head for the Correctly. When you say, what do you mean by head? So take however big you make the character's head. Uh huh. Double that, and that's the torso. Put or basically take two of two of that size, and that should be your approximate torso. I've never We're learned this in school. The head. I never like learned normal, this. In school. Like the normal, like say a normal person would be seven and a half, seven and a half, or like four or five or whatever. And then like you know. This is, again, this is like shit you can like find in like any sort of like, like, you know, how to, like, you know, basic, like, basic, like, you know, drawing, like, you know. Like how to, how to draw shit. Yeah. I'm with Geist, I just kind of like wing it. <laughs> I'm winging it. Well, no, because like I told you guys, I never, I never, I never, like, learned in school, really. I just, I just kind of like, I just kind of liked drawing, but nobody, but everybody around me said, no, no drawing, it's bad. And, uh, I stopped. And I took up writing instead, and, and that's a mixed bag, I guess, too. Listen, your newest project was actually, like, was actually not that bad for one time. Well, Someone weird that spelling and grammatical errors, yeah, but other than that, it's like... Everyone has weird one. grammatical and spelling errors. Uh, that That is a fucking... Th there is no perfection in that market. There's a reason why... There's a reason why there's professional editors. Yeah. If we, like, like I said, like... I... I, this is not, this is not Merrick, this is, this is not a official statement from Merrick. This is, a, this is an official statement from Merrick. Go to school, learn stuff, okay? But I'm gonna be honest with y'all here, right? Even I'm like, did I really need a degree to say that I'm a good writer? As someone with a degree, ouch. <laughs> Once again, JT, don't feel too hard on yourself. Let me explain why, right? Remember, C's get degrees, and you can't spell degree without D, so you're good. I'm still working on my degree, technically. I'm going- I'm getting a bachelor's. The spirit art is coming from inside you and doing what it feels right. Exactly. I don't need a pe- like, I don't need a pe- I don't- the only reason why I say, like, you know, about, like, half of these fucking things and shit like that is because, again, if I didn't, like, take reference to, like, these, sort of, these sorts of things and all that sort of shit, like, yeah. you know, again, I still consider myself as an artist a 6 out of 10 or whatnot. Like yeah. Like, I can get down, like, proportions and anatomy fine and all that sort of shit, but, like, you know... I'm just happy my stuff I comes out. I can't realistic and like my fucking shading and like lighting needs so much fucking work. Look, me, me as but an I artist, me as me as an artist, I'm just happy my thing comes out looking as good, looking as good as they do. That go like I don't know. I, I have a weird I have a weird eye for detail. I'm actually excited to share this week. I'm actually excited to share this week's drawing because it's the first time I've ever drawn that specifically. And Zig, I, Zig is in on Zig is somewhat in on the joke that I made on the that I made with it though. Because um, what what is it like? Everybody everybody just knows like what I. I just did things to be in video production. Now I know why I barely draw. Now I know. Now I know how to barely draw Homer Simpson. Yeah, no, like, I, what is it? I, I have, like, I have, like, a bunch of, like, 
random skills that I've learned from school yet. I never finished. But the thing is, though, is that, like, nothing stopped me from continuing my own education in it. I just don't have a piece of paper that tells me, you know, that I'm certified in this, you know what I mean? We need a certify- right. Well, it, here's the thing. There's two things regard. there's two things about that. Yeah. While, yes, I fully believe that we live in an age that where, where independent study and self-learning is invaluable. Right? And Give it up have... for the teacher's age, JT! Sorry. I've already said my philosophies on teaching. teaching it, it, several, I believe a couple times, but regardless. Um, read the science. Oh, okay. Learning by saying, doing. There we go. <laughs> that is, uh, the tact tactile learning is is, 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 not, is something that I personally think is underutilized in most school systems. But, you know, what do I know? No, it's <laughs> the thing. It took me forever to realize I was a tactile learner. You know why? Because in school, we only learn how to, we only learn how to do by either visual, hearing, or writing it the fuck down. And I hate writing notes, so I'd rather be- I'd rather- Alright, if we had a science class, I'd rather do an experiment than, like, you know, nothing at all! Oh, you're very hands-on and shit like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's a, that's a tactile. Like, I, like, I wouldn't- like, I would I wouldn't learn how to use my streaming software. I don't- I, I- I- Number one, I don't use it to, like, the full extent. Like, I don't have, like, 20,000 hotkeys that I could touch to be, like, you know, Hacker Man. Do -do 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 -do. Where, you know, I look towards the camera that's not there and go, we're in. Like, just learn by doing. We got the trousers, Gromit. Sorry. The trousers. The I'll say this: I am not someone who, who learned well by doing because I will, I will, I come to the wrong conclusions a lot when it comes whenever I do that. Uh -huh. Well, all right. Like, if it's math, no. I, I, like, I'm not, I need to, I need it explained to me, right? I feel like, I feel like people have, like, it, it's not, it's not a, um, I don't think we're, like, also, I don't, I also don't think we're, like, fully beholden to one style of learning, because... Oh, no one is. Like, alright, I, I, I'll learn, uh, like, by literally doing, I will learn something, right? But, it's, like, for other stuff, it's, like, you have to explain to me math. And, and you have to explain math to me, and then I will try to do it. I probably won't pick up on it because fucking math is a terrible subject that, honestly, like, a lot of subjects really should only be learned, like, advanced, like, like advanced shit by people who are going into professions for math. But, I can like... Explain. I can explain why we... I can explain the reasoning why we learn it. I'm not going to say it works, but I can explain the reason. The, the, the hypothetical reasoning why we do learn, learn the higher end, higher end mathematics. So, so JT, I, expla explain to me, Mr. Teacher, Mr. Teacher's Ed, explain to me why we learn mathematics. Why we're forced to learn mathematics. So, the goal of, um... The goal of every, the goal of every main subject is really, is really to teach a skill, right? Yes. Yeah. So, most people... So typically you learn science so you can understand and and the science like things like the scientific method and ethic performing experiments. Oh, of course. And, and understanding that, you learn you you know you do you learn reading so you can understand so you can get at like li like cultural literacy and stuff like that. The I, the the, per, the goal of learning math is to is for problem solving. You, Jimmy has five apples and needs to set and needs to give him the three to spread. Can, what all right, do you do? All right, can I can I can I just ask you one question? Is so why why does Jimmy care about the apples though, huh? What is he some kind of health nut? Oh god damn it! Okay, not doing this okay, yeah, okay, 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 fucking Sheen. <laughs> Now you see that's a social. Now you see if this was a social studies class, that'd be an acceptable answer. Well, no, that's no, that's the thing though. That's the thing though. That's my thinking. That's my thinking half the time when it comes to like math classes like that. 
Because I swear, I swear, I've fully gotten a sub- Like, I've fully gotten, like, some subject matter in math, right? Then I'm sit down with a test. I'm sit down with a fucking test. I am shown everything, right? And I swear that, like, one of the answers was, like, a trick question. Or there was, like, one an- There was, like, one question. I think this was a science- I think this was either a science test or a- Or a social studies test. The, the, but like the point like I, I've, I've had weird test I've had like weird test questions at some points but anyway I I have I have had like a math question right that I swear was trick I even said to I even called the teacher over I said this is a trick question there's no way I there's no way you could probably there's no way you could possibly answer this and she was like oh yeah you can I'm like what the fuck are you talking about you can I did every freaking process that was taught in the freaking class and I can't figure this out this has got to be a trick question. And then, like, what was it? Because what was it? I, 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 like, I knew, and I knew the answer. I just didn't, I knew the answer, right? Two? I just couldn't show the work possible. Because I'm like, the process is not working. I know the answer, but the process is not working. Yeah. Math might be easier to adjust with more visuals than just the raw numbers. Yeah, like I feel like once again we once again I, I do think that we got this. Kind of, this kind of circles back to the point of, of certain people being visual learners, auditory learners. Yeah, stuff like that. Now, I'm gonna say this: the goal of teaching higher in mathematics is to is to teach problem solving. Yeah. Does the American education system succeed in this? Fuck no! <laughs> I feel like I've solved more problems in science class than I've solved in math. Or, like, learned problem solving better from science classes. That's because they teach- that's because science- the, the, the science is teaching a different kind of problem solving. It's more- it's more like... personal experimentation. That's the goal of most science, of, 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 for most science, which is a form of problem solving, experimenting and figuring out the solution to your problem. Whereas math is just like a lot more, a lot more, um, you solve practical problems, not like problems like what is beauty. For that, I, I fall into your familiar with philosophy. You know what I mean? Like, exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Exactly, you know what I mean though. Like, you get, you get what I mean though, right? Yeah, I get it. I still- I still can't believe my- I still can't believe at one point in time my English- my English class tried to turn it into a ph my English class or- they tried to turn it into a philosophy class or whatever. Oh god. I can see the correlation. No, but it, was, it wasn't even like, it wasn't even like, good philosophy though. Wow. It was like, I, like, you know, his heart was in the right place, I th you know, his heart was in the right place. Ooh, hold on, hold on, wait, you're talking to someone who's taking their philosophy class right now. I want to hear this. What's a, what, what makes something good philosophy? Well, wait, for me? Like, what is, how do we, def what, how do we define good philosophy? I mean... Ain't philosophy just like random observations and being like, ain't that a little weird? And then like, you know, thinking about it and like trying to process it. That could be a definition of it. I feel like JT is sitting back with popcorn, like listening to me. <laughs> I, if, I, I feel like I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm more going for the vibe of like sitting back with a glass of wine. Interesting, tell me more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> free, free, free therapy from JT. It's not therapy. It's more just. It's more just like. It's more, more just. I. You know what I feel like. What's up? There's, there's one meme I saw. I love this meme, but it's an asshole meme. Where like someone just goes, oh, "What's this?" And then a guy just goes like. It would show a picture of a skull, right? And then one goes, what's this? And then one guy goes, a cranium. Um, a skull. Mm. What's this? A manor. A haunted, a haunted house. Mm. 
like he's just fucking like the guy on the like just sitting um like sitting fucking being an asshole criticizing the the, the common user. I, I I I love the I love the um I love the voices. A cranium. <laughs> a cranium. <laughs> that was that was very. That was very... That's what was, that's what the guy did. That's what the guy did. <laughs> Where do you work now? What, at the library. Call... That's like very at the library. What do you, what do you call what do you call this? It, what do you call this? A guy a MacGyver. A skeleton. Hmm. What do you call this? A ghoul. Slow, a ghost. Slow, mm. <laughs> the mm, <laughs> the mm, what adds was to even, it. What was even like Ziggs, are you asking how we got here? Yeah, like, how did we even get down this fucking, like... What are you... Hey, what are you staring at? <laughs> Kirby story. Warrior. Ziggs, Ziggs right now. What the fuck are we talking about? Like, we, we, we kind of just came down here, this whole fucking rabbit hole because of, like, fucking... No, like, isn't that... No, 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 that's the thing, though. Wouldn't... Isn't that not, like, philosophy? Because Zig noticed something weird about the situation he's in? No, this is just more yeah. so, I'm kind of, this is more so, like, I've been tired all day, we started this whole fucking conversation about, like, you know, fandoms and, like, all this sort of shit, and then it just became about, like, art, and all that, all that sort of stuff, just because you wanted to show JT, like, your freehand stuff, or whatever, and whatnot. Zig's fucking, like, you know. Zig's is mad, oh no. I'm not fucking mad. <laughs> Diggs, how was your day? I, I was just tired all day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, wait, did it say Neon Nugget? Neon Noodle. Neon Noodle. Neon Noodle. <laughs> what was that? What was I going to say about, um, what was I going to say about, uh, that whole, that whole scenario, too? Oh, I didn't- I didn't get enough fruit. We need- I need more fruit. You need more fruit for your fucking Yoshi friend, though. I need, like, one more piece of fruit. And I, then you'll get the bean star. No, I need, like... Need three like more, more- Three, three more. more pieces- No! Five, five more. Six more! Oh, no- Oh, this was the tedious one. Right, 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 right. I gotta travel around and gather those up, and then we gotta go back to the Chuckle Huck Woods. Yeah, we gotta go see the Chuckle Nuts. And watch some TV on the Chuckle version. Me with a blobfish like at mine. Chuckle Tunes TV. <laughs> it's what you're watching. <laughs> is, that what it, is, that, is that what we're watching? I guess. I wish Modern Man was a new oh, no. reference. Ch -ch chuckle vision, chuckle vision. <laughs> I I've been exposed to British TV through uh, Monument, and uh, the funny as the funny part about it is, I've heard that British TV was terrible. That person who said that was wrong. Cause uh, like TV can be funny. Like what is it? Strange Hill High has been has been a very fun show. Chuckle Vision has got some very funny bits. I feel like vindic- Harry Enfield and friends. What? Harry Enfield and friends. Oh. He's the loads of money guy. Oh. Loads of money. Oh, speaking of- Boy, speaking you of shut your mouth and look at my wand. Grab life by the conquerors. And anyway, so speaking of cartoons, uh, I was watching Rupert, which is like an old, like, cartoon that's just like- it feels like anything can happen in that show, yeah. Uh, what's it called? What's it called? Rupert. Rupert Bear. Or like, not Rupert Bear, but the show is called Rupert. But it's about a bear named Rupert. Yeah, I remember Rupert. It, it's, it's good. It's entertaining. It, like, it's a little out there, but it's entertaining, yeah. Yeah. White, ba white bear, yellow scarf. Yes, red jacket. 
Oh yeah. my god, we did a song for him and shit. It has a 6.9 on IMDb, it has to be good. 6.9? I mean, that makes sense, because like I said, the plots are like, out there. But, now the thing is though, what I want to talk about is not about Rupert actually though, because, uh... Rupert was a show I put on because... I needed to go to sleep, and I was tired of watching Garfield, and like, waking up to like, the fucking, uh... Waking up to like, his sass in the morning, when I was like, ill at first, right back in October. Burn crap, I'm like, I woke up one day, I'm like, I can't fucking take Garfield anymore. I can't fucking really listen to that Garfield, fucking sarcastic cat. Lasagna. So really put on, I, 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 table, I, I, I jumped around from, I, I like lasagna. I jumped around on like all of like the fucking free shit on Tubi. So I, what is it? I put on like Marvin the Tap Dancing, classics like Marvin the Tap Dancing, Horse, uh, Jane and the Dragon, all that crap, right? A lot of, a lot of the like. Second one sounds familiar, but I've never heard of Marvin the tap dancing horse. Okay, it's about a tap dancing horse named Marvin who lives on a fucking, uh, lives on a fucking circus, and uh, they have a slave human child named Calvin, I think. Okay. What a bitch. <laughs> and there's, there's a, there's Please. a talk. It, it was no. made by the, it was made by the same people who made uh, Maggie and the Ferocious Beast. Great. Great. I was about to say, because <laughs> there's a pig character in that show who reminds me of the pig from Maggie and the Ferocious Beast. Uh, yeah, Hamilton. Yeah, but uh, Did but it's a girl, and Hamilton? she's like, and and every five seconds she's like, every five seconds she's like, oh no, something bad is happening. And then there's also an elephant, and they have to perform at the circus because the other circus has clowns, and they fucking hate clowns with a passion. And I'm not kidding about that. Oh, okay. But anyway, once Why? again, once again, this is not about Marvin the Tap Dancing Horse. What I really wanted to talk about was this show that I think is French, but I also might think is Italian, but it takes place in France. Uh-huh. So, I... Old. Okay. So since Rupert, since Rupert went away, because I, I watched it all and whatnot, right? Uh-huh. I put on this- I was just like scrolling through one night and I'm like, I, I'm like, I gotta get to bed, I'm tired. So I found a show called Memories of Manette? Mag I don't know how to fucking pronounce it, but, but the show they call her Marinette. It's- It's- It's a Flash show? I don't know when this came out. There's no information on Google. Except for like IMDB, and I. Memories of Nanette, of Nanette. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. I I swear to God, I've heard of this show. And I've been Memories watching it. I'm like, Nanette. this is pretty okay. Like, it's cute. It's not like fucked up. Uh, well, it, it's a little. I, why have I heard? It's a little fucked up, but it's show? not. It's a little fucked up because like her aunt's a bitch. Her aunt's a bitch and her grandfather's sometimes an asshole, but like, I'm like, I'm like, w w this, it's, it's such a familiar, it's like the game Obscure. It's the most, <laughs> bless you, bless it's you. the most familiar bless show you've never watched. Bless you. Why the fuck is it, why the fuck is all I'm seeing of the show in green? Yeah, right, yeah, when you look it up on like, <laughs> You'll get it on like. Oh god! Oh, god. I'm not coming down with something. <laughs> well, if you I if you Google well. it, if you Google it, all you see is like the Greek uploads to YouTube. But I'm like, why? Why in Greek? No. But it's probably, on it's on Tubi in English. That's probably the country of origin, or it's like that. Some like the uh, YouTube channel is like originated from like Greek, from Greece and whatnot. You know what I mean? It's Greek. They don't even have an economy. <laughs> We're already. It, oh no! It's, it's only. It's a, it's a French. It's a. It's Where a did French you family. find this information from? IMDb is your best friend. Oh my yeah. God! I I was like. I'm like, I just want to find a Wikipedia article. Is I, I, I am maybe more for Wikipedia article and then just like, you know, use the well, the, well, the, the thing is, is like, I don't like using IMDb because like, 
it feels like it feels like it doesn't have all the information because a lot of the times it don't. So I was like, oh, I'm probably never gonna sure. if I if I look at the IMDB page, I'm never gonna find out any information about this. So I was like hoping in vain to find like a Google article, which never showed up. So I'm like, what the fuck? I want to know about this show a bit more. But like, it, it, like the title sequence, the title sequence is like, it's so on the nose. It took me a moment to realize, I'm like, oh, that's the girl as an old woman. That's the girl in the show as an old woman. She's uh, reminiscing about her childhood. Yeah, that's yeah. The show. Yeah. And the time period's a little, like, weird. Also, there's like a fucking, like, redneck kid with, like, buck teeth, and he's clearly, like, in bread or something <laughs> ah the french making fun of americans it's nice to see the other way around yeah he reminds me of like an american kid and like the villain like like all right all right like uh, re-watching a bit of mlp right sometimes in like season one a lot of the background ponies can be assholes like real fucking assholes but the village children in this show are Fucked up. Like, they make fun of him for being a country boy. Like, look at his buck teeth! Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I'm like, what the fuck? To be fair, I would also make fun of I would also make fun of the country bumpkin. Well, that's the thing, though, is that, like, he, like, he's a country bumpkin, but he knows how to, like, fix things or something like that. Oh, so we were gonna use... So he really is just playing to the stereotype. Yeah, but for some reason, like, for some reason, because, you know, uh, uh, like, uh, I guess that's the country boys or whatever the fuck, like, he, he, in the intro, they, like, he's giving flowers to the, he's trying to give flowers to the girl, but she runs past him to hang out with, like, the fucking, like, regular person. And the regular person is, like, a dick somewhat. It, it, like, I, I, like, I don't know. You gotta like re you gotta like watch it to get it like understanding. I know I, I watch it when I fall asleep, so I wake up to it and I fall asleep to it, so I only get like scant details. But it's got like it's got like good animation, and I'm like, this ain't too bad. Like it's it's relaxing to go to bed to. And the plot of the second episode is the plot of the second episode is like fully understandable. Uh. I, I said this like I, I love meat. I love eating meat. Yeah. But if you told yeah. me if you if you gave me like the slaughter gun and told me, Merrick, Merrick, we're gonna eat some. We're like you're gonna go into like that that field over there, right? And you're gonna shoot this cow, and we're gonna eat it. I'm gonna be like, uh, uh, I ain't eating the cow. I'm shooting. I can't live with that. I can't live with that blood on my hands. The plot of the second episode is like she 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 likes the rabbits that they're raising in the farm, right? But they're raising them for food. That's what I thought. Man, rabbits. Yeah, rabbits. Rabbits don't even make good food. They're making rabbit stew. Well, ask the French. They would ask the French. I'm mad. At, I'm mad at killing rabbits in a pro like like it it, it 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 takes more calories to hunt a rabbit like in the wild than to kill and eat it. Then no, it, it takes more it takes more calories in, to hunt a rabbit in the wild than you would get by eating it because of how much fur and bone and all that shit on a rabbit. You know you know what's if well, you, you if you live if you were in a forest. Uh, let me finish the point real quick. If you were in a forest and you had and you only hunted rabbits for survival, you would starve. Hey, it's just, it's just like the game. Don't starve. But like, exactly. no, but no, but like the thing is though is that like too, I, I like, I, I I would never like if you if you made if you like you know. I would never do that. But the thing is, too, like, how you say, like, rabbits, like, you, you waste more energy trying to, you know, survive off of rabbits and whatnot, right? So, uh, I, uh, JT, have you, have you heard about, you, you know the story of how the dodo went extinct, went extinct, yeah? Oh, overhunting. Yeah, and that was, like, 
that was, in terms of, like, current times, yeah, that was, like, somewhere in, like, the 17, 1800s, 1600s, that, that era, right? Right. And you know why they hunted the dodos to extinction? Because they were easy? They were stupid. The dodo bird was stupid. The reason why it was yeah, stupid, stupid was because it was gigantic. And the reason why it was gigantic basically had no predators until man showed up, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. But the thing is though is that like JT, you know how you said you'd wait you'd waste more calories hunting a rabbit and killing a rabbit to eat it and whatnot, right? Right. Yeah, the dodo, as it turns out, their meat had no flavor. Their meat, or, or it did have a flavor, but it was like terrible. And the calories that you got from it was like nothing. They killed and ate the dodos for nothing. So, like that—that's my—that's my argument for the, that's my argument. Like with the rabbit thing, is that like people will do it for nothing. Like it's not a, it's like, it's not a matter or care. It's like, it's like, all right, people eat bear meat, yeah? yeah? Who the fuck is going out hunting bears specifically for their meat? Oh, nice. That's a more, that's a more wholesome, yeah, eating pizza is a more wholesome option. Maybe that movie about the turkeys, maybe the movie about the Thanksgiving turkeys was right. Back in time, to the first Thanksgiving, to get turkeys off the menu. That's right. I I I, I still think that that movie like that, that, uh, nameless coming around with the pizza while we were talking about like who who who's going around hunting bears for bear meat specifically? People who are either suicidal or want to try it. Well, because once again, once again, bear meat you you need to cook it thoroughly. If you don't, you're getting a parasite and dying. Holy shit, you reminded me of another story. Oh god. So do you so so do you So you got true actually. Parasites. Paras god damn it. Parasite! So remember how you said you like you like woke up or like you know, like like you woke up early to like like some bullshit for like some kind of cartoon? Anything you're mentioning, Nick? Yeah. Earlier? Back in like early high school, that was me with like Gumball. Because like I didn't really have a chance to watch cartoons when I got home from my home. And it was only on at six in the morning, right? Yeah. So normally, I don't want to watch Gumball at 6 in the fucking morning, right? So yeah. I did, so, so, yeah, I don't want to sleep past her. Like, I'll catch the last five minutes of an episode. Uh, but one day, right, I decide, you know what? Fuck it. I'm going to set my alarm for 6 in the morning. And I'm going to watch and I'm going to wake up and enjoy some nice Gumball, right? So... I set my alarm, I start watching the episode, right? And something 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 strange happened that day, right? For you see, that day was the first day of many where my, where either I had a parasite or my stomach shut down. What? Did you have a tape form or something? Wait, I don't know. Wait, but wait for a the second. Next, like month, I could not eat solid food. Wait, you had a parasite? Wait, JT, you had a parasite? It was either a parasite or Yes, Mario um, inflation. <laughs> or or my or my stomach just shut down. How does your stomach shut down? I don't I don't know. Like for like for like for like basically a month, right? Uh, any any solid food I ate came up in a matter of minutes. That, that reminds me too of like ba back when I actually like watched anime a lot more than I do now and I was watching like fucking Bleach. So this dude, this dude like 
turns into like a, a, a spada thing or whatever the fuck they're called, yeah. So what he does is like he absorbs the energy or power of someone and he makes like a weird looking like doll of them. And then what he does is, the, the one guy specifically, he's like, he opens, he pops it open, making like, oh, I'm gonna rip you in half, I'm gonna rip you in half, ah! He pops it open, and inside, there's like little, like, clay or glass representations of the dude's, like, inner or internal organs, yeah? Uh -huh. Yeah, my Discord, why? He's like, he's like... He's like whittling his fingers in. The, he's like whittling his weird fucking fingers around inside of like the doll, and he's like, "Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Ah, uh, here it is!" And he pulls out. He pulls out like the little one that looks that looks like the stomach, and it says "estomago" on it for some reason because I forgot why there was a lot of Spanish shit in Bleach. Anyway, oh, son of a bitch. So you you know what he does to it? He just what? squishes it in his fingers. It like breaks. And the dude just vomits up a ton of, like, water. And I'm like, Did that just fucking happen? I couldn't believe it. That just happened. He survived his stomach dying like that? What? Hell if I know. Also, I won't say for the record, it, I don't think it was a tapeworm. I don't know if it was actually a parasite or just my stomach shut down. The tape or like for a hot minute, I could not eat solid food, right? And then eventually it was just like, okay, occasionally I could have a banana. And then the doctor was just like, okay, you've been you've been missing school because you can't fucking you don't you literally cannot process food. JT, I mean, you, you forgot food. how to eat again. Quick, I'll get the no, funnel. I'll get the funnel. Oh god, don't even. They're like, okay, so here's what you're gonna do. So you can stay awake and have energy to survive your day. You're gonna go on a liquid diet. And I'm like, and I'm like, oh, that's gonna be fine. So and you, then, like, you associate Gumball with like this, uh, with this problem you had? No, but it's just like, the one day I tried to do something for myself. You know what I mean? <laughs> the one day. J um. JT, you deserve but good things to happen to you, man. If only they do. I would, but, uh, it's okay. I'll just keep trying. Regardless. Fake it till um, you make it, cries, and, like, I don't know. Um, I, I remember at the end of, at the end of that, right? I've been on a liquid, I was on a liquid product over a week, right? Uh-huh. My grandfather had a barbecue. Oh, and you're like, oh, you, you, you were like, oh, I can't eat this. No. I literally, I looked at my father and I go, I'm going to eat this fucking burger. I'm going to eat this burger. And if I throw up, I'll, uh, so be it. And he's like, all right, your funeral. And I ate the burger. And that was the first thing that stayed down in like over a month. And I was so fucking happy. Okay. Okay, I, I, okay. Once again, I don't watch anime. I, 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 I don't watch anime anymore. One of the last ones I watched that I'm like, okay, maybe this will be good, was Tokyo Ghoul. And no, Tokyo Ghoul is not good, but that's besides the point. Um... The, the, thing, the thing that... The Man, thing, this co this is very ironic for today's coffee corner. Please continue. Oh, God, what did you do Tokyo Ghoul related? Not Tokyo Ghoul related. Oh. Anyway, as I was saying, right? So, so I, I watched Tokyo Ghoul. So the, fir the first plot point comes up after, like, the dude gets, like, attacked and, and like, half-eaten by, like, this ghoul bitch or whatever the hell they are. Um, so, what happens is, so he gets, like, a ghoul organ inside him, so he can't eat, like, normal meat, he can't eat normal food anymore, he has to eat, like, people flesh, and get prions in his brain and crap, so, yeah. uh, he has to eat, like, he has to eat, like, people flesh now, he, he, he can't eat anything, so, uh, so, JT, I gotta ask, were you, like, did you get, like, a ghoul organ in you, were you turning into a half ghoul? 
man, I don't. I, I, how do I? How do you get? It, how do I cure myself? Then if I do that? No, you don't. You don't. There's no cure. It's well, like diabetes. Well, there's, there's no cure. I mean, I can eat solid food now, just fine. You got ghouls in your blood. <laughs> I don't know what happened then, but like, hey, I'm fine now. Like, I, I, I hate I hate the plot of Tokyo Ghoul, bro. Could I just say this real quick? I hate yeah, sure. I hate the plot of Tokyo Ghoul. Okay, so basically, ghouls, right, just like in actual mythology, uh, ghouls are, sub, are subspecies of human. But the thing is, though, is that in Tokyo Ghoul, instead of being like a subspecies of human that is just like a normal human, except they live underground and eat people, they have superpowers and eat people, right? So now, now they have superpowers and eat people, right? Why are they, why and how are they not the dominant species on the planet? Exactly, exactly. That's the problem, right there. Yeah, I was gonna say the indomitable, the indomitable human spirit was not a myth. No, humans are like humans are like shit. Like humans are like fucking shit. I don't understand how they how the ghouls have to hide in society. I don't understand how the ghouls have to hide in society, right? But like I I, I was like I was like so geared up, I'm like, oh like this is gonna be interesting, like we're gonna the dark dicer too. Oh brother, alright. Wait a minute, uh hold on. Fuck. Um, um, uh, where is it? Where's my phone? Um... Okay, okay. Is Mario a level behind? I think so, yeah. Okay. Hold on, okay, in that case I'm gonna take a picture of Luigi's stats and then compare. Uh, dice. Dice, uh... One HP. Okay. <laughs> okay, Mario needs to level the fuck up. So, um. Oh, it's only yeah, for Mario. Okay, okay. Oh, that's only for Mario. Yeah, that's right. It's a fucking upgrade, though. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. But, um... But yeah, so like how ghouls are not the dominant species on the planet, I'll never know. But then, like, but then there's like super powered half ghouls that fight normal ghouls. I'm like, this is fucking shit. People, people watch this and enjoy it, and I'm like, how? The logistics don't make any fucking sense. So yeah, Tokyo Ghoul is a bust immediately out the gate. So GT, you want to have your coffee corner now? Okay, let me refill, let me refill my water real quick, and then. Yes. <laughs> I was gonna say, I do hear something in the wind, but, uh, that works too. Can I make a Krabby Patty now? No! People just enjoy any shit, that's just a- Like, I- like, I understand different strokes, different folks, all that crap, but, like... Sometimes there, like, sometimes there are things that just make me go, How do people like this stuff? It's just weird. Like, it's just strange. What was it like the like the last one that made me do that was uh, Black Clover? I, it's just that it's just that like Squidward moment of why do you people eat this stuff anyway? That kind of reminds me. I got a. I gotta fucking watch goddamn Pluto again because I I stopped I stopped after the second episode and it wasn't because I thought it was bad or anything like that. Far from it. I thought it was fucking good. What a show? Those things were Pluto. It's on Netflix. Pluto. It's it's basically it's a detective show and there's like you know fucking. Astro Boy characters and all that sort of shit, you know what I mean? Well, that sounds cool! Jo um... 
our good pal Johnny Galaxy has talked about this show a lot and whatnot, and he and he recommends it and shit. Oh, that reminds me too. At uh, so there's this guy in my town, right? He runs like one of the surf shops. So dude's very nice. He, he brought in a bunch of like comic books that he's got, and he was selling them. So I picked up uh, I picked up like this random comic from IDW with like these Astro Boy looking characters. Hey, what's it about? Like, like a little superhero team, but like space themed. I think I didn't read them yet. I still have them. Oh, okay. Like I like I picked up a bunch of comics because I was like, oh, these covers look cool. I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna check them out. And like they're two dollars each. I'm like, you know, si like six bucks. I can't go wrong with that. But it looked like it looked cool, and he was selling. Oh yeah, like, no, it's pretty cool shit. I'm like, oh yeah, no. But um, you know that, that I guess that Zig just reminded me of that. But but uh, something's on the wind, JT. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Welcome everybody to JT's Coffee Corner. There we go. God damn it. Alright, ladies and germs. What have you been so, up to, JT? Like Nick, I am not someone who partakes in anime a lot. <laughs> I, I, I maybe, maybe watch like one anime a year. Unlike, if unlike. That, right? Unlike, uh, unlike me, anime does not piss off JT. So I want to ask you, before before I get into, because the show I ended up watching, I fell in love with. What, what, what do you not like about anime? Ah, uh, the list. The list goes on and on, JT. Okay. Give me some, give me some like the big boys one. So okay. I, want, I, I want to know if the pitch is going is, is gonna go is gonna be is gonna go wasted or not. Okay. Over sexualization of characters. Oh my god! Mario just super speed there. What the fuck? He's got like a, a, he's got like a it's you got the iron thing. You're way more. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So yeah, like the the over. All right. So the over sexualization of the characters. The, okay. That's one. That's one of the big ones. The just the like and shitification of shonen anime. Like the oh, like we, there's so much shonen stuff, right? And not and not only that too. It's just that all right. You think that because there's a lot of it, is that like okay? There's got to be at least like one or two diamonds in the rough, right? And this is not me going like old, old shonen's bed. No, because a lot of my favorite animes are shonen shit. Right. It's just that like it's just that like specifically right now there's so much like shonen. There's so much like shonen, but a lot of it is like bad, bad shonen. And that and that leads into like that leads into like the same problems with uh, that leads to like the same problems like the over sexualization of the characters, just the overabundance of shonens. A lot of like, and a lot of it where it's like okay, the plot is cool, but the so execution I, is just bad. So can so can I make an can I make an analysis then if if, if you don't mind me? Sure, I'm sure. You can, I'll gladly let you psychoanalyze me, JT. Is it less that you don't like anime and more that you don't like the an the era of anime we're in? Is that is that a more fair assessment? I mean, I've seen like bad ones from like older generations, but like that that I, I will not lie that the generation of that we're in with the anime is a symptom. Okay. Okay. I tell you, you watched that dungeon show as of recently, JT. Oh, the, the dungeon food one? Yeah, is that, is that tonight's uh, topic and shit like that? No, I've been meaning to look into that, but... Oh my okay. god, because like, I was about to say, that was one where I'm like, I'm not watching this. I don't care. Get it away from me. Well, okay, why not? Oh, hold on, wait, now I'm curious, why not? Like I told you, I, I like I told you, I just don't like anime. 
Gotta look for the weird shit. The artsy, the artsy weird shit, like uh, Angel's Egg. I feel like I've heard of that one before. But I'll look into that. So yeah, JT, you were, so yeah, JT, you were, uh, you were saying sorry. So, I recently found a kind of anime that kind of I swear, I, mean, I, I intended to watch it kind of like in like something something to have in the background. I was like, I worked on it, right? But you paid attention yeah. to it. Yeah, I made the mistake of paying attention to it, and uh, holy <laughs> shit. So what, what's this? Um, what's this anime, JT? This anime is known as Ranking of Kings. Ranking of, of Kings or Ranking of Kids? Kings. Kings. Okay. So, it is about how, effectively, one, one of the strongest king, kings, king, kings, uh, king boss, right? Uh-huh. Uh, recently, re is basically on his deathbed, right? And his kingdom is going to, to, his, to one of his two sons. Either, either his youngest son, un un Prince Didus, or, as the crown rightfully belongs to, who Prince Doji? The problem. The problem here is that Prince Doji is is both mute and deaf. Oh. Huh. So, effectively, no one no one takes him seriously. No one respects him, and the, and to top it all off, he's weak as shit. I see. The anime takes zero time to kind of show you that I, I like anime. I will say one trope of anime is, uh, is, is underdog plots. We all know they love those. And this one is no exception. Uh -huh. This is a very good example of an underdog plot done correctly because you see where where our main character is just kind of coming coming from and a lot of the stuff they do. Stuff they do. I have never grown its own more attached to a silent character before, but character than I have Doji in a hot minute. But not only not only focused on on effectively seeing Doji become the king he wants to become and you know earn the right to the throne, we also see kind of as he leaves to go on a journey. The show is filled with very character and character driven, um, like, political drama. Mm -hmm. People kind of, you see the, the, the queen, the queen herself has a, has a various amount of, like, royal guards, right? Yes. Yeah. And in the beginning of the show, in private, the queen basically said, all right, I, Put your thumb up if you think Doji Doji has Doji should rightfully you know wear the crown. Right? I don't know why I don't know why I thought you were going to say put your put your you said put your thumb up yeah yeah I don't know why but I thought you were going to say put your thumb up your ass I'm like what <laughs> no, no, no 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 um but basically it's like all right all right. Raise, basically, raise your hand if you think you can. Um, if you think our, our, he, he would, he would make a good king, right? Uh huh. And you see who who does. Cough directly you into my see, mouth. And you see effectively their sides of like trying to ensure who gets the crown and who doesn't switch itch throughout the show. Oh. And almost, almost, like, especially when you least expect it. Now, despite being a very political, like, a, a very, like, like, who gets the crown pol politics and, like, inspired thing, the actual action scenes fucking slap. We get, you get some, and they have a, they have a good mix of both, like, intense, high blaring music ones. <laughs> the um, that, you know, like like of like of like two people sparring and going at it, right? Uh huh. Um, 
And then, then in, in some of the earlier episodes, one of my favorite ones, right? It was a guy with a sword versus a guy with a spear. I'll say this, there's not really powers in this show. It, it has over-the-top shit, but it's not like... You're not gonna see someone fucking shoot fireballs and balls that often. You know what I mean? Yeah, Thank no, fuck for that. Most of the actual... Most of the action is either is either just weapons, sparring, or a dude fight, or, or someone fighting a monster. You still see, like, over-the-top shit. Like a guy flexing so hard that his armor pops off. But like... Nothing, nothing like fucking... No one's going Super Saiyan. You know Hon what I mean? Honestly, honestly uh -huh. too, JT. I'm, I'm glad that you mentioned that too, because another anime that I have a problem with fucking, uh... Also... It's not Tokyo Ghoul, but it, it's similar-ish. What the hell was it? Demon Slayer? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Air breathing, water breathing, fire breathing. Yeah. <laughs> and then, no, no, and then, no, the girls, the girls can't learn, uh, the girls are not allowed to learn, uh, fire breathing or water breathing. No, 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 no. They have to learn insect breathing or love breathing. I, 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 you know, you know, me just talking about that real quick, I wanted to reach over, I wanted to reach over my desk. I have like two bottles, uh, I have a, uh, a Corellian Corvette and a, uh, a Star Destroyer, right? I wanted to reach over my desk real quick and just take them, just talking about, like, while I was talking about this, take them and then smash them together with the fucking Death Star blowing up music. Oh god. But but I will say this, right? My favorite actor I've seen I've seen Geist. half of the first beat. Guys, this is anime. There are no non-binary peeps. You either get like big chested women or men that look like fucking twinks. Good. Good news for you. Most of the men in, 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 in ranking of kings are roided the fuck up. So it's like JoJo then. <laughs> not that extreme. Not that extreme. <laughs> and I you love JoJo, I mean? so it's it's like the, the art style itself is very soft, very like '70s esque anime. Although some people compare it to actually like a comic book style. Like a, like, a, like, a, like, a, like, a, like a Western cartoon style. Yeah. It's a lot soft. It's a lot softer in colors. It's a lot like the the, the character. The, the character looks like how most people draw a frog in anime, and that's I mean that in the best possible way. I don't know why my mind went to Akira Toriyama. Uh -huh. Frog from uh, yeah. Chrono Trigger. Oh yeah. Okay. No, not that. I, um, I, I I love I love. Uh, look, I just want to say this, right? If you draw a frog with like all like the bull whips and shit, fuck yeah. Uh, sorry, fair. that's all I have to say about that. No, you're good. You're good. So like, the, the, my like, the favorite fight scene in the whole thing. It's a guy with a sword versus a guy with a guy with a spear. Simple. It's clean. You see, you see weapons. You see, you see weapons break. Is the, there you go? You're seeing. You see. You see. You see. The, the, both of them having to like adapt their strategy. You see both of them having to. Uh huh. To, Sounds like, like Samurai Jack a little bit. Kind of. You you do see weapons break, especially with this on the spear guys parts. Um. And. The, uh, one one last thing I'll point out. The show loves to betray what people know about it. Or just shows in general. It's like when when I I have a I have a qu I have a uh, I have a question for you for you all, right? Yeah. 
let's say like in a show, someone's you know evil guy, evil guy just goes, huh, I'm got, I got to, I got to betray and assassinate the rest of my members, right? Uh huh. What normally, what normally happens? Uh, it takes like two thousand years for anything to happen. Or like, the question. Let's say like evil guy in anime just goes, I have to secretly betray my 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 old my old friends to to for my own personal gain, yada yada that shit, right? Yeah. Well, either they they fucking do it or they or their plan gets like you know sabotaged. Right. Normally, norm normally, like you see them kind of like go through it, and like they get like either they get to the very end and are foiled, or like they succeed and then and then like they reveal their machinations on this shit, right? Mm -hmm. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. What? Here, this is just one example of how they like fuck with things. We see. We see the character approaches to do that, right? Yeah. Then we proceed to my favorite fight scene of the show so far, and the assassin loses. And everyone's just like, oh, huh? And then we see, because of that, one of, one of the guys that swore loyalty towards one of the princes switches sides and then proceeds to do, do shit on the home front. And then just like every character's actions directly imposes imposes the new result on the other character's actions, and it's it's so fucking good. Fuck yeah. Seriously, recommend it. It's on it's on it's on Crunchyroll and Netflix. Give give it a give it a shot. Fuck yeah. Oh! That, Oh, you want to speak? You want to speak about a game? You want to speak about a game um, that that made me go, "Damn, I kind of damn, I, I I like the gameplay, but as soon as as soon as the game, because like this is like from PlayStation Two era, as soon as it got to like the like the ladies that you're kind of supposed to like ogle and shit, is oh, when the God, game yeah. got is when the game kind of got like boring." A lot, a lot of games that go for sex appeal do not work. Well, the all right. Yeah. So the, you want to know? So I, I bought the so I bought the game because I'm like, oh, vampires, vampires, guns, the old west. I'm like, this was made for me. What game is this again? I played Dark Watch on the oh, PlayStation yeah. Two. So Dark Watch, the YouTube link. It works on- it show- it's shown to work on, like, uh, my thing here. Yeah. And this thing- yeah, yeah, like, like it, it- it opens up the, uh, YouTube. It doesn't work on my phone, though. Like, it just doesn't show up. Oh, I have a good one, Nameless. Ah, oh, here we go, I finally found the spot. But um, where was I? Right. So Dark Watch, right? I I I I, I like it. It's weird and cool in like fun ways. But then I got to like I think the halfway point of the game. So in the so the first so the first uh, NPC you sort of meet right on the adventure. She is this like no nonsense blonde-haired southern lady she's like fully she's like fully cloaked in like the dark watch the dark watch uh, like outfit and whatnot right right and she's like you know like we gotta get we gotta get you to the dark watch outpost because we gotta save your life son right. and um so she just fucking dies immediately oh yeah, like you meet up with her again, and she just like this is a this is an unofficial like Merrick uh, Merrick's uh, tea time, but uh, we're, we're like this. I'm not talking about like the full game because I haven't finished it yet. 
she fucking dies, right? But, um... Then, then, at the halfway point, right, you go through, like, this death maze at the Dark Watch outpost because the dude there is, like, pissed off at you because you're a vampire. And at the end, he's like, oh, get, get ready to meet your new partner, partner. And then it's this, it's this fucking, like, goth emo lady with big boobs has her chest exposed and like the outfit on her is very form-fitting instead of like you know being the normal dark watch garb or whatever the fuck right and she's like and she's like oh oh uh, jericho you got so like i'm ex i'm exaggerating for effect here but she's like oh jericho you got such a big penis like man Man, I, I, like, I like walking on, like, the darker side of, like, stuff or whatever, right? Like, I am totally, like, I'm trying to be, like, this, she's trying to be, like, a temptress and crap, and I'm just, like, ma'am, stop. You're making this worse, right? Yeah. So, I, so I'm, like, I'm, like, you know, right, so, so immediately after that, right, you, you start the next level and what happens is she's like all right she's like all right. she's she's the one leading this attack that you're going on right and she's like all right you all right you uh peep all right you people you better you better like make me proud out there and stuff right and the dude next to you the dude next to you goes like after she like walks away he goes to, he turns to you and says like man i love men I love being under her, especially when she's leading. That's such a good view. Am I right, buddy? Uh. And I'm like, dude, I, I like, she's trying way too hard to be attractive. Stop it. Don't, don't fall for it. And, 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 and like, you know, I, 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 I'm like, I had to stop the level. Like the level itself was a little annoying. So, and then that just wasn't helping me that just wasn't helping me like get into it and I'm just like this is this is the game just turned dumb didn't it this is the part where like we have to keep the players attention I, I was like uh-uh no -uh, I'm not I'm not uh playing this right now <laughs> so I stopped for a day right I stopped for a day I came back to it yesterday and I, I was still playing it and that only happened at one level, and she's been sidelined for most of it. It wasn't until I googled the plot synopsis and I found out more about what's gonna happen afterwards. So despite me- despite me, the player, not being turned on by this, because it's so fucking obvious what they're doing, uh, the, your, your player character cannot resist the temptress, oh no no. So they they have a night of passion in the hamburger patch, and and he bites her and she turns into a half vampire and betrays the order because I don't know. Huh. Yeah. Early two thousands games are fucking weird. Other than that, I, I like the gunplay. I, I like the idea, the setting. Uh, you fight like you fight like monsters and they have guns and then there's like zombie cowboys. And, like it's cool but then you get to that part and it's like yep 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 and apparently is she the... like in the rest of the game or is she just like a, like a yeah she 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 is like she betrays you and then she becomes like a secondary antagonist and it turns out apparently if you shoot so my choice your choices throughout the game don't matter right Apparently, the ending the ending that you get is based off of a single binary choice at the end. So you could be evil throughout the whole game and still get the good guy ending. Oh, it's one of those. Yeah, because you, you do you do have a choice, but I, me I'm just like nah. I'm, I'm just gonna like save everybody. Fuck that. Uh. So the the ending. Like, you, She's either the final boss or the ghost of the of the lady who helped you at the start's the final boss. And uh yeah, that's about it. 
I'm like, I'd rather fight the vampire dude you're chasing after the whole game as the final boss. I, 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 this, this drama, this love drama tension thing did not work out with me. I'm like, this is dumb. I just want to fight, what, what is it, uh, I just want to fight fucking vampires and zombies with guns. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck, I, like... It sounded like they, they, they really tried to fucking... Like, make a fan service character and it just did not service the... Like, you can do fan service correctly, you just have to, like... I guess, for like, I guess, mean something, does that make sense? No, like, I bet you, I bet you if I was a stupid kid, I'd be like, oh yeah, let's go. But no, I'm like, I, I'm like, you, you, you brought me in with like fucking vampires and monsters and like werewolves and the shit. And I'm like, yeah, let's go. And then, and then I get to like, and then I get to like, you know, the fucking lady that's like all over the main character that I do not see the appeal in. I'm like. Okay, game. Can you please stop? I'm not into this. Stop it. Like that. Like that. Like that's. Like, I guess that is like a bad fan service character. Also, it just seems like 90% of their personality, from what you said, was just like being having sex appeal. Like no one talks like that. Come on. Like. like I'm taking the piss a little bit when I when I do my uh, descriptions and whatnot. Yeah. Right. But at the same time, it's not entirely incorrect what I'm saying. She she's literally it's like it's so obvious that she wants to fucking like you know. It's so obvious that she's all over like you know she's all over the main character Jericho. Like he's a slice of foot, like she's butter and he's a slice of toast. It's yeah. so obvious that, like you know. And then uh, what? What's the? I, I forget the name of the other. I, I don't even remember both of their names. But like, but the other lady's like a voice in your head the whole time, right? And she's like, I don't trust her. Stay, stay away from, uh... Stay, stay away from her, Jericho, or some shit like that, right? And, and I'm like, and I'm like, I'm with you on this. I don't want to be anywhere near this other lady. That's basically it. Like, Dark Watch is a good game. It just got this, like, weird fan service in it. And then I'm like, I'm not, I'm not comfortable with this. This has not made me comfortable. This has just made me go, I had to take a break from the game for a day because I'm like, the levels got boring. It picked up afterwards, but like, I don't know. Had a rough patch. Yeah. Had a rough patch. Because, like, because literally the serious tone the serious tone took a backseat for like fan service for like 25 minutes and I'm like, oh. I'm like, I forget, this is an M-rated game in like 2000, whatever this came out. Of course there's gotta be this type of shit in it. So I gotta, like honestly, like, if, if we were on a different side of the internet, right? If we were on a different side of the internet, like, there'd be people, like... There'd be, like... There'd be, like we, if we were on, like, a different side of the internet, different people, we'd probably be like, Oh, like, man, that, that part was, like, the best part or some shit. I don't know. But it's like, I've grown, I've grown up beyond this crap, but it's just like, Oh, right, I forgot. I forgot that that was a thing in, like, these games sometimes. Okay, I guess what, what can you do about it, you know what I mean? And I mean, and, and, and like, the thing is, though, is that, like, we won't, we will never see a game like that again. Not in terms of the fan service, just in terms of the gameplay and style. But at the same time, like, at the same time, the only game 
has like stuff in it that's just like very like ha. Finding these fruit. And they're only like around this part of the uh, map and shit. Yeah, I believe so. Every every fucking area looks the same and it's like, oh did I get this fruit? Yep, we gotta go to another spot. Yeah. I think it, I think this is the part where I stopped playing on my old file. This or I almost had all the. Did I get this one? Here we go. Checking. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, you're around here. Oh my god. And then other than that, other than that, uh, I got reminded of a thing I watched like. I got reminded of a thing I watched oh, no. from like way back- oh shit. From like way back when, and when I say way back when, before I grew- like, still before I grew up a, a smart brain. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it here, uh, uh, because I don't- I don't want people to look this up, to be fair. And it's not even like- Bad, bad, it's just stupid bad, like... This is what people thought was entertaining? Hey, did you get the one where you, where you had to, um, push, like, a giant Koopa out of the way and shit? In, like, the northeastern part of the kingdom? I don't... Let me tr let me look. I know I pushed- I know I pushed a Koopa out of the way, but I don't know if that was the guy. Is it specifically blocking? Is it specifically blocking it, or is there something else that it's, uh... Oh, there's something else to it, too. I might have gotten that one. Did you fire a piranha bean? Where is it? Northeastern part of the kingdom. Alright. Oh, there real quick. Ugh. Might have been around here and whatnot. North. Bean bean. Oh god. I'm so fucking deep. Damn it! I'm fucking blame you. Go oh, those days. Yeah, it's like the day after like a huge like after like a three day weekend where it's like you know, Kinda, you kinda want like an extra day, day just to like relax. What's even what's even like worse too? At yeah. least for like the I, I mean it's good for us because you know we get at least we get at least a day to be like whatever. Because we don't stream every day anymore, like I'm, I'm taking we do stream and this is the week for like a boat and whatnot. We yeah. got two days of nothing and then we're back to Friday. <laughs> Oh, oh, actually, I'm not gonna be around on Friday for the concert. Oh, cool. <laughs> we had another, we had, uh. Yeah, so, so, sorry to, like, you know, drop this on you, like, beforehand and whatnot, but, you know. Just, <laughs> I that's 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 whatever. I really don't mind to be fair. Huh. Can I drop off of the ledge here? No, I can't. Damn it. Would have had it we would have had like a right moment there been like yes we made it through that stupid gate but no nope. 
It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh, jeez. Took up my glasses for a second. Ugh, scratch my eye. Ugh. And if I do, there we go. <laughs> I wonder. No, that's nothing. No. Nope. And we can't reach there via high jumps. That's Teehee Valley. Bike right. Is there one here, I wonder? I feel like the chart around here. Oh no, we double check. He tastes it, tastes tastes it some more. I get like chuckle beans, I get like beans, but I don't get the bean fruit. Yeah, no, I get it. There's gotta be like one up there, and I don't know how to get up there. Wait. Alright. Okay. Um. Wait. Merrick, go back to the beach portion of like. Oh, you're there! Wait, what? What happened? There we go. Oh, you're actually fucking... Okay, and it's not there. You have to go... Hey, Sprinkle. Hey, hey, Sprinkle. Hey, Sprinkles. <laughs> Sprinkles the clown. Why is that Koopa... Why is that Koopa so chunky? That's just the, uh, giant Koopa. He ate, he ate a lot of the chunky soup from, uh, Campbell's. Or, not yeah. Campbell's. No, it's Campbell's. Oh, that is Campbell's? Yeah. Now you have to use a hammer and shit. Ah, uh, right, 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 right. Cool. My brain, my brain is not working <laughs> right now. How many I need? I needed like six, and I found like... Th five. Five? You did five. Let me double check how many I got in the inventory real quick. I think I got like four, I hope. All right, bean fruit. Three, I'm missing two. We should get one over here. Oh, wow. I shouldn't have jumped out. Oh, wait, we wouldn't have been able to get across the bridge anyway. Yeah. Oh, hey, this is the area where uh, the ship was. Now it's underwater. We killed those pirates a second time. All right, so how the hell did we get it? All right, so how the hell? There should have been a piranha. Fire. There should have been like a piranha plant that like eats the fruit and shit. Like 
right there and whatnot. Did you, did you already, like, then again, you already, like, unless there's something missing in here. Skeletons can't drown. Trust me, they can. Wait, do you have to talk to the, like, guy back at the fucking thing just to explain it? I did, and he, I did, and he said, what are you looking at? No, I, not the, not the assistant, like the actual fucking dude and whatnot. In the egg costume, I did, and he said, what are you, he said, what are you looking at? I feel like we're missing something. Solo fight a uh Yeah. Alright, it's almost it's almost like twelve o'clock. We'll worry about this next time. Okay. JT isn't even responding anymore. I'm here. I don't <laughs> know. <laughs> we've lost we've lost uh contact with JT. I'm I am here. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Nintendo! Oh, it's okay, JT. We know you're here in spirit and whatnot. And in body. Hey, Wesley. How you doing? <laughs> we just got done uh, right now. Because uh, Zig's tired. I'm tired. I don't know if JT's tired. Oh, yeah, I'm very tired. <laughs> We're all tired. Yeah, nah. Um, yeah, sorry. Sorry and whatnot. It's all good, guys. We're, 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 we, we did have a, we did have a fun conversation. You can always check out the VOD if you want to catch yeah. up and whatnot. But, either way, there's some good shit. Wait, what's up with multiverses? I've seen a lot of people playing that again. I thought that game got, like, abandoned. It, it apparently, I, I think it's coming back. I think they're picking it back up. Wow. I'm surprised by that. <laughs> like, no, like, legit. Because that, like, usually, especially with games that come out of that studio, specifically by uh, Warner Brothers and whatnot. Damn. Like. I mean, they'd be a fool. They'd be, a fo they'd be foolish not to. It's fucking Warner Brothers. But this is David Zoslop we're talking about. Okay, but, like. And just smash, it's the closest thing we had to, uh, to smash for the competition. Content for it. Really? Yeah. Like new characters? I guess so. I'm not really sure. Mm. Alright. Well, new characters. If anything, I'd have to like. So I'd have to like. I thought they really. I thought they were gonna release at one point. They were gonna release like a gremlin or something. Oh yeah, they did release they new characters. Wow. They released a couple gremlins. A couple of gremlins. Those were the new cool. characters. Oh, a while ago. I thought that that. I thought. What, so what did they get now? Uh. Because I've seen. I, I've seen people play it, but I've not seen people talk about it yet. That's the crazy part. Because usually I hear about it before people like... It's, it's like a relaunch and all that shit. I just don't know what... Ah, I get you. I see. Man, I remember when everybody turned their back I on I know it. Jason Voorhees is in it and shit. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the big new character. Okay. Okay. That's funny. That is funny. Alright, let's raid... Uh, Yoshi, are you okay? But uh, what did do you think we learned anything tonight, guys? Um, Aside from you know, fucking what you call it came back. Aside from that, um, text Merrick one for if you want a couch. What <laughs> once again to enter the raffle for Zig's old couch? You text. <laughs> You text Merrick Ishtar 1 here in the Twitch chat. You text Merrick Ishtar 2 here in the Twitch chat. If you're watching this on YouTube, you text Merrick Ishtar 3 in the comments section. 
subscriber subscribers viewers of the tri of the Twitch channel or the YouTube get double the votes. And if you're subscribed to both and come on the, your social security number, number you get th triple the votes. I, if if people actually do it, I will add votes. But do not if you do it, do not give the social security number. I feel like if someone, I feel like if someone actually posts their social security number in the comments, Ziggs, I think you are legally obligated to give them the couch. <laughs> Yeah, they're an instant win. <laughs> they instantly win. It's a nice couch, though. I, I like it. It was very soft when I slipped on it. Z Zig, it's do you agree? It's a very comfy couch. <laughs> is, it, is, it a, is it a sleep? Is it like a is it like a futon? Like it can fold no, into a bed? No, it's, it's like an couch. actual like couch with couch. very soft cushions. Yeah. I did sit-ups on it too. Like it was, it was, it was a very nice couch. Very like is it very soft? Good shit. For two hundred dollars, you can't beat that. <laughs> but but we're, 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 we 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 <laughs> you heard you heard it here, folks. We are doing this special giveaway for this very special, probably not one of a kind couch. <laughs> if you if you if you if you if you give if you give him five more dollars, he will sign it for you. <laughs> Oh man! Give him twenty more. Give him twenty dollars on top of the asking price. He'll throw in a copy of his e, of, of his of his ETB. Make it make it twenty six. My what now? Make it twenty six and Zig will forge the, my the, EP. The, the, EP, make it, yeah. Make it twenty six. I thought you said like APB. Like I, I have an all APB on the fucking purple <laughs> shit. So no, 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 Zig, no, Zig, no, no, no. Zig, you're gonna give them a copy of the game ABP Reloaded. God damn it, I forgot about that shit. <laughs> well, no, 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 if you, no, but if you send Zig $27 in pennies, he will also forge oh. my signature on the couch, too. If you give him all $200 in pennies, he will file a restraining order. <laughs> uh, this giveaway, <laughs> this giveaway is not included. You have to pay shipping for the couch, too. This giveaway yeah. is not... Heroes of the Storm is still around. Too. Oh yeah, right the 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 one with uh... bro. I, bro, I tried playing them like 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 three like a couple like a, several months ago. It took me like twenty minutes to find a match, and I had, and I still oh had no idea what the God. fuck I was doing. You, know, you just you just play as like weird looking JC from the Lucio. You play as weird looking Lucio from uh, Overwatch, and there you go. That's how you play Heroes of the Storm. Uh, I like that. I, I think I think yeah, for now <laughs> I think for now we all need a break. Anyway guys, thank you guys for joining us tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed. But remember, as always, be yourselves and remember <gasps> Mega Lega I Mega ID Ho. Mo Mega Chai Mega Mo Mega Hey. Pickle Bro come quad Jimmy Cherry Changa. That's the secret word of the day. Alright guys, catch you all later. Merrick out. See you guys. Good night everybody. Bye-bye.